Who am I speaking with? This is Atsushi Iwata from NEC. Excellent. And you guys just won Best of Interop winner for this device that is right here, the programmable flow switch, PF5240. All right, what makes this thing so damn awesome? Yep. Uh, so tell me about it. The, uh, okay. The uh, uh, Prono flow, flow switch can provide, uh, based on the open flow, uh, to provide a very flexible network configuration, uh, providing the uh, automatic topology discovery, uh, automatic configuration, and then on top, we can provide a batches network, multiple batches network in an automatic way. We can plug and play in a server, a storage, and the firewall load balancer in a very uh, so, uh, secure way in an isolate, isolated the, uh, network segment. So as I understand, let me see if I got this right. We, these are switches on the top, correct? Yes. And then right down below here is the programmable flow controller. And then normally we would have software in the switch, but you take the software out of the switch and you put in the programmable flow controller, correct? Yes. Explain the purpose of that. Okay. The, uh, we use the open flow concept, and then the open flow can separate the routing software from the switch into the controller. And then the controller lands all of the software, including routing and traffic control, and uh, topology discovery and other application like integration to the network appliance like firewall road balancer, everything can be uh, la uh, 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 lands on the uh, the uh, network uh, the open flow controller, and then uh, we control the from the controller to the multiple switches in a homogeneous way. Therefore, switches look like a single big switch or a single big router. Then uh, the uh, we, we can we can manage in a network in a very very flexible way. So really what can happen is these switches up above can just be sort of yanked out, plug and play, and they'll be automatically configured or deconfigured, if you will, correct? Yes, right, right. Uh, therefore, if the uh, switch has broken or link has a failure, then the uh, controller automatically detects and, uh, and then the rerouting is automatically done. And also, if we are, want to add a new switch into the network, or if we want to remove the switches, then we can provide a no interruption type of service integration. Excellent. Hey, thanks so much for your time. Thank you very much.